It's Major League Soccer on Comcast Sportsnet. The Revolution hosting FC Dallas at Gillette Stadium. So Highlighted here is Benny Fellhaber. Very important for him to distribute the ball tonight and get a lot of the ball to dictate the pace. Hernandez will sit in front of the back four. He's the most important player for them in terms of dictating the pace. He'll distribute the ball and try to link up with the forwards and wide players. Uh, fans have tributes planned as well. More on that later as Dallas wearing the red and white hoops kicks off from left to right. Shari with an important win there. In this space for Caraglio. Can he catch up with it? Well, yeah, after it had drifted wide. He uses the heel flick for Zerka, who delivers. Shari's there, and he puts it in the back of the net. Great build up play from the Revs, and they lead 1 0. Shari Joseph with a career high eighth goal of the season. Perfectly designed as, as Shari Joseph wins that ball, takes it over, plays it wide to Caraglio, who collects it. And look at this. This is a teamwork effort here. This is a good view from up top as the refs take this ball right here. Shari Joseph gets to it, beats two players, and he plays this a little ahead of Karagna, but watch this one-touch heel right here. That's the play. It gets to him quickly, and Zerk a one-time ball to Shari Joseph penetrating, buries it near post, and the refs... ...in traffic. Vilar. for Shea. A little nutmeg in on Tierney. Somebody lost a shin guard. It's wide for Lloyd. His cross. Wide open Santos. Could have put it anywhere on target, but there and scored. Terrific ball in by Zach Lloyd. Well, Zach the Lloyd, yeah, there, yeah, Zach Lloyd gets forward and he hits it one time perfectly. Santos heads it right at Matt Reese, and Matt Reese in his Barney uniform makes the save. Then he's ball with the back post. Caraglio's there. He bounced it over and wide. It's the second time we've seen that. It, he's not used to playing on the turf. <laughs> Well, I think he's shocked that that happened again, where he just he does everything right, creates a little bit of room, he jump, jumps over his defender and heads it. That would have been in it. It's just a little bit wide, Brad, as you see here. Hartman comes over, nothing he can do, and it's just wide as Jacobson's covering on the back post. We couldn't get it away. This is Jackson. A little one-two. Jackson loses his feet. Elar still going. Slide tackle from Failhaber. Centering pass. Overhead kick. Well held by the keeper. That was an athletic play. Really sort of a, a low bike. Very athletic as A.J. Soares is down from that collision that happened earlier in the play. And watch this. This A.J. Soares is down and Jackson's left all alone. And look at that going away from his goal. Flicks it back. Matt Reese is there. But look at the athleticism, the concentration. Hits it well, but Matt Reese there to cover. Oh, one wise pass there. Caraglio's in, can he finish? No, off the side netting on the wrong side. He couldn't punish the error by Jair Benitez. It's a tight angle, but the Revs will feel like their DP striker needs to put that away. Credit Kevin Harmon. Look at this. Benitez, just a blind ball and a very terrible ball. And there's Kevin Harmon. He comes out. And That's a just, yeah. It's a good play, right? He gets him just wide enough, and I think Caraglio obviously took a little heavy there on the touch. Great ball work there by Jackson. Shaving his shoe. On the bounce, covered by Reese. But wow. The ball seems to be on a string with that guy, Jackson. Some fast feed from Jackson. Able to open up his hips, create a little bit of space, and fires a cracker at Reese. Reese handles it well, but... Revs, with, with Jackson pushed high, the Revs defenders are going to have to keep him in, in the peripheral the entire time because he's so shifty and can move around. He gets a lot of opportunities. Lekic on porch one. Great save by Hartman after Caraglio created the opportunity with the pressure. Well, that was a laser by Lekic. What a strike. What a save there from Kevin Hartman. We're going to get another look at this, but that was Caraglio created a little bit of space, put him behind, and then it was Lekic who got the on the end of it. This time he's offside. Watch this strike from Lekic. Good looking view here. It was just pressure five from Caraglio. And then look at this one time hit. And what extension from Kevin Hartman. Well hit from Lekic, but even better save. Wow, that's going to be up for save of the week, Brad. On the keeper, Reese off his way. loose in the area. And AJ Soares took a hard hit as he cleared there. The initial play made by the Revolution keeper, so the two former teammates with L.A. and UCLA making spectacular saves at either end of the field. And, and, and Matt Reese keeps his feet and goes down at the last second. A.J. Soares cleans up the rest of it. The forward, Benny Failhaber gets in there for the Revs. Tierney 
Barnes with the right foot has a lash. Oh, and just beaten away by Kevin Hartman going to his left. Von Luna now. Santos drives it and a great save by Reese. Great save from the man in purple. He reads it well, Matt Reese. As he sees this ball come in, he can't catch it. Santos touches it in and just flips it over. Look at this good touch in, left foot strike, and it's moving and bending. And Matt Reese does what he can to parry it over the bar. Corner kick department there, six for Dallas, five for New England. Bell Hopper again to take from that far left corner with the right foot on the in swinger. A little flick by Cochran finds Leckage, who finishes 2 0. Ryko does it again, and he's saying it's over. Good finish from Ryko Leckage. He peels off back post, but credit Benny Bellhaber and Ryan Cochran. Cochran goes near post. You're going to see this ball come in. There's Cochran, and he just puts it up and over everybody. And there's Leckage back post. One time ball near post, and that's a great finish. And you see it ball comes right up over everyone. That's why it's so dangerous when the near post is a good run. Everyone's out of the play, and Leckett's near post slides it in. Good play, and he says it's over. Hall's spinning side volley is the last action of this game, and the Revolution get their first win since July the 20th, their first win at home since the middle of May. Big sigh of relief for Steve Nichol and his staff who finally see a game out and they had the lead. It wasn't always pretty, but there were good moments as the Revs defeat one of the better teams in MLS, Jay.